What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video here on the channel. So today I have decided that I'm going to take the mountain bike back out and do a little trout fishing and uh, not just typical trout fishing. We're going to use a fly rod today. I have not done a fly fishing video so I decided hey it's a super hot day. I want to be near the water just like the previous video so let's go do a trout fishing video near some cold spring water so that's what we're doing today uh, if you haven't seen the previous video i did another mountain bike video where i rode my bike down to a creek and then i did a little catch and cook so make sure if you haven't seen that to go and check it out on the channel it should be the last video but i'm gonna go ahead and pull the track out we're gonna go see if we can't catch a couple fish on the fly y'all stay tuned so we started on our descent down to where we're gonna be fishing we got this hill to go down so it should be a pretty good breeze once again, it's another day where it's like 90 degrees outside. So it's a scorcher for sure. So there's some pretty cool little sections to fish down here. It's not a huge creek by any means, um, but it's so fun to catch these native fish. I mean, they're just small and you're just tossing into these little pools of water, pulling them out. And they're some of the most prettiest fish that you can catch. Let's get started. <laughs> well, I didn't quite realize how much the water was gonna be down usually anywhere you see rocks like all up along that all up along that that's literally always covered in water so i think what we're gonna have to do i think we're gonna go to the very top spillway and try our shots up there because this is not gonna hold any fish unless i find a deeper pool along the way i mean that's that I've, that's the lowest i've probably seen it in a long time it's just so hot so let's work our way up to the top we'll mess around on some bike trails and uh, let's try to catch a fish up there see how it goes I think we'll drop right down here. There's a decent little pool. I'm not sure how it's going to be though with this water being so low. That is very narrow. Oh, yeah, that ain't fitting. I'm going to have to walk it. So I don't know if you guys are going to be able to see this, but as soon as I was pushing the bike across, I looked to the left down this little pool, just right there, literally right off the side of the bridge. There was two decent native trout. It looks like native rainbow trout that are in there. And uh, we're going to see if we can put this rod together and try to catch one. I'll see if I can get one on film right now. But I think it's gonna be really hard to see. You see it right there? It just swam past, like right in that opening. So I'm gonna get this rod together right here, rig up me. I don't know if I'm gonna do something that sinks or something that floats. Um, I guess I'm just gonna figure it out when I get there. But I'm gonna put you guys on a tripod, get the GoPro rolling, and let's see if we can catch one of these fish. Now we gotta figure out our weapon of choice. Let's see what we got in the arsenal. We'll go with that. I don't even know what this is. So that's going to be our weapon of choice today. I'm not even sure what it is. I'm not that familiar with fly fishing. Um, but we're going to tie that on. Small, kind of looks like a mayfly or something like that. And uh, I know these fish are going to be eating flies and that kind of stuff that lands on the water. So we'll give it a shot. We'll see how it works. Got to sneak back across this. I'm going to try to get on that side right there. So I can kind of cast up underneath. But I don't want them to see me while I'm walking across. Okay, that spot was a bust. I think they saw me when I was pushing the bike across. But we also have one more pool right up here, so we're gonna go give that a try, and then we're gonna work our way to the top of this creek. But first, we gotta stop and do a little berry snack before we get to fishing right up there. You always gotta do your berry snacks anytime you see some nice succulent berries on the side of the trail. Mmm. Mmm. Little army crawl over here. Might have to get up above. This is very difficult to do with this long of a rod, especially in a place like this. Oh, oh, we had a hit. We had a little hit. I don't know what it was. Oh yeah, that's some deeper water right in there. Let's give this a shot. I'm just trying not to be seen. Oh, dude, one just came up. There's a little one. So hard to cast this. I'm having to like slingshot it out there. Well, on to the next spot. I have not had that good of luck so far, but we haven't made it to the good spot where I want to actually go. Um, those were just kind of, I don't know, just mess around holes that I saw along the way that looked good. And one actually had fish in it. So that was pretty cool. But I think I spooked him when I walked the bike across that bridge. But now we're going to head up to the good spot unless I see another hole. We had one. Dang. We had one. 
I literally had one bite and he just spit it right out. Literally, I have the bike right behind me. I just had to set you guys down. And I saw one swimming right in this pool. That's sick. That's a sweet start so far. <laughs> So we finally made it to the good spot. This is where I wanted to come all along. And literally, right as we were pulling up, I saw that trout right there, casted to him, um, but he just spit the lure. I don't think I yanked it out of his mouth. I don't know, I probably could have, but who knows. But this spot right in here, just right below where that water's falling, is usually a really good spot. And then we also had this little back corner. It's really covered up in brush right now, so it's probably not gonna be the best spot to fish, but we're gonna see what we can hook up to and uh, just have fun with it. There's the first fish of the day, guys. Look how pretty the coloration on that fish is. Just a beautiful wild trout. I don't want to lift him too much out of the water just because I don't want to rub his slime off. But what a beautiful, beautiful fish. Oh my gosh. We're gonna go ahead and let him go and try to catch a couple more. With these wild fish, you really can't handle them too much and you gotta get them back in the water as soon as possible. But wow, just look at that fish. Just the red in its tail and everything. Golly, that is amazing. I was literally trying to get pictures of that fish and try to get some video of it. And this lady comes up to me with her dog walking right past, clearly sees I was filming right in this pool and lets her dog go running right out there. Have some courtesy. I mean, like, I, I'm not mad at that. I know it's a public place, but still, I mean, there's all of this that you can get in, all that right there. There's a whole creek following the whole trail all the way up. And she decides to go right in the hole that I'm fishing in. I don't know, it just didn't make sense to me. But nonetheless, we're gonna get back out and see if we can't get a couple more of those fish. They are so pretty and I love catching them, especially on the fly. And right here you have a little bit more space to be able to like cast and go back and forth. So it's pretty fun. You kind of get some practice in on some tighter sections. But as soon as I cast it right up there, I was actually getting ready to rip it and bring it in and I got hooked up to that fish. So that was stinking awesome. Let's throw it back out there and we'll see if we can't catch a couple more. Oh, there we go. There's another. We have another. Oh, there's a really big one. There's a really big one behind it. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. There's a really big one right at it. Okay. I'm gonna leave that right there. I'm gonna run over here, get the big camera. I'm not bringing them out of the water. Oh my gosh, look at that. That is gorgeous. <laughs> oh my gosh, that is awesome. Let's get him unhooked and get him back on his way. There's a bigger one that followed him up. We're gonna see if we can hook that one, but that is stinking awesome. We're going after the big one. I saw him follow the other one up. It was a pretty decent trout for this creek. I've never seen one that big in here. All right, well, this is my last ditch effort on trying to catch one of these fish. I don't wanna harass them too much. I kind of feel bad. We've caught two, so we've had a good time catching fish. But I'd like to catch that big one in there. That thing, for this size of a creek, it's a pretty nice fish. And it's a really, really pretty rainbow. I really don't even know what I'm throwing, to be honest. I'm just picking stuff out that looks like something that would be around here, like an ant or like a mayfly. So this is what we're going to throw next. Just looks like a little ant or something. And it is going to sink. It's not going to float. So it might give us a little bit better chance on some of the fish that don't want to hit the top of the water. Oh, there we go, there we go. Oh, that's the big one. We got the big one, <laughs> let's go. Yes, 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 yes. <laughs> oh my gosh, yes. This one's the good one. This is the one that followed that previous fish right up to the bank. Oh my gosh, that's awesome. That is stinking awesome. I knew if I switched up, they'd probably hit it because they were not hitting the surface anymore. They just, they were completely sketched out on that. All right, I'm gonna leave them in the water. Reel them up as close as I can to the bank. Just set that down. I'm gonna get the big camera. Don't yank my pole in the water, guy. Did he just get off? He just got off. <laughs> <laughs> I 
Well, I guess that was a pretty easy release. I didn't want to touch the fish, so I just set my pole down. As you can see right there, and uh, somehow he figured his way off the hook, which is good. He's going to be back in the water. He's going to be super healthy because I did not touch him. But I wanted to get a cool release shot. That was the big one. I'm going to cast a couple more times um, and just hang out up here for a little bit longer. Then we're going to hit one of the mountain bike trails and head on out of here. So we'll get a little mountain bike action in this evening as well. up today's fishing portion of the video the fish are kind of spooked now they're not hitting fish for a little bit longer um, but I haven't had the first bite there's a couple more fish in here that I can see I can see them they keep coming up to the fly but they're kind of sketched out about it and it's not gonna bug them anymore we had our fun with them we caught three I wish I would have had that big one on camera that was the big one that followed that last fish that I caught up um, it was a beautiful fish hopefully this camera got it but it would have been cool to have some underwater shots Oh yeah, that is freezing cold. Anytime you come here, you always gotta drink the fountain of youth. It'll make you young forever. <laughs> this is such a pretty rod, I love it. This is one of my favorite trails, definitely. Over here, it just feels like you're in British Columbia or somewhere, just riding on the side of a mountain. Just cut out of the side of this hill right here. Awesome. Here we got the big old tree. Now we gotta go under because we don't want to get decapitated. Right into the coffin tape. Well, I guess I'm gonna finish this video up right here. We got to incorporate the bike. We got to hit a bike trail on the way back. And going up, we got to ride it a little bit. And we got to have some fun. Caught three fish. So overall, a stinking awesome day. And I couldn't be more blessed to be able to do this kind of stuff. And as always, if you enjoyed this video, please leave a huge like on this video for me. It just helps boost this video. Also, if you're new, please subscribe and hit the notification bell. I post two videos a week, Wednesdays and Sundays at 7 p.m. So you're gonna have to keep a lookout for that. I love y'all. Thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next one.